Here's the information on Severino. The MRI revealed rotator cuff inflammation, and Meredith Morakovic reporting this, will be shut down for two weeks. Because of the two-week shutdown, Aaron Boone said it's highly unlikely Severino will start the season with the team. I hate rotator cuff inflammation because, or any kind of inflammation, because there's a, re, there's got to, what, what made it inflame? Why is there rotator cuff inflammation? So whenever something like this happens, the first thing the team's going to do is shut him down for two weeks. Right. They're not going to cut him open right away. They're going to shut him down for two weeks. So I don't think that people should look at this as negative, nor should they at all look at this as positive. Just because they're saying rotator cuff. All the spring? What was it? Uh, no, this, this, right, this so is going to be his first start. That's a problem. Then he can't, because you shut him down for two weeks. He's going to have to have extended spring training, right? He, he's, if he's okay. I mean, they better. He hasn't thrown yet. They open the season on March 28th. If they get him back the second or third week of April, they they'd probably be thrilled. So he's going to, according to Brian Hoke of MLB.com, receive an injection and anti-inflammatories, then resume his throwing program. So essentially, he starts from zero. All the throwing he's done before today. Mom. Is wiped away. He's got to start from zero. It's going to be a slow process, and you cannot rush your franchise arm to get him back sooner. You just can't. Well, if you missed it, John Heyman tweeted a couple of hours ago that the Yankees had interest in Gio Gonzalez even before this happened. So, if you had interest in him already, well, why not just bring him in? Sign him. We'll see. If you had interest before, which means you were thinking about bringing him in knowing that you had five healthy guys in your rotation, well, then... If you think he's going to miss a month, well, then, then you got a really good pitcher. They can be a part of your rotation to replace. So all of a sudden, the start of the Yankee ro season, no CC because he's suspended for five games. And they started him slowly because of the heart surgery. Uh, now you're not going to have Severino. So Boone said Herman and Loisega are the top two candidates for the rotation. Boone also said, according to Eric Boland of Newsday, rotator cuff inflammation. Otherwise, the MRI looked pretty good. But they saw inflammation in the rotator cuff. That's a concern. Again, we don't want to sound the alarm, but boy, that's a concern. As for Aaron Hicks, according to Boone, Aaron Hicks is, quote, dealing with a little bit of back soreness, not something I'm too concerned about. It's amazing how quickly things could change in sports.